I'm Tim Joyce and we're at the Old Town School of Folk Music in the Music Store and today we're going to talk about travel guitars because summer's here. This is my own silver tone three quarter and it's all laminate but it's it was $85 and I just love it and you know when I take it on vacation or it goes to my nieces and nephews I really don't have to worry about it quite as much as any other guitars that I have and they actually sound pretty good too. The Martin Backpacker. This is an all solid wood instrument. Obviously it's a little untraditional in its look, but it makes for very, very easy, you know, transport and travel. A lot of these travel guitars are made um, so they fit in an overhead compartment in an airplane too, which makes it great for business travelers as well. We have lots of students here at the school who, you know, come take their lessons and then they go on their their business trips during the week and then come back and take the lessons on the weekends and a lot of them have these travel guitars so they can take and practice in their hotel rooms over the, over the course of the week. You have to admit that even the smaller guitars that we've already looked at, they're still a little bulky to be carrying around with a bunch of other stuff. This one's really tiny and can even like stick on the side of a, of a backpack literally and I think there's, Martin has pictures of folks all over the world on mountaintops and in the jungle with these, you know, so I think they that's sort of the, the goal of this one, is that it's really small and really portable, but you still get a chance to, to play and practice your guitar. Another option is the baritone ukulele, which is tuned exactly the same as a guitar with the bottom two strings, the E and the A, taken off. So all of your chord shapes, you know, still work. So if you can play the guitar, it's a very easy transition to the baritone ukulele and obviously a very small instrument to take on vacation.